and we are back at it again one more time again and again and again and again anyways we are here at the goodwill in buford right down the street from the mall of georgia it is considered the mall of georgia goodwill so been here before really like it so let's see what they have And it is blue tag, but I'm just starting to think that that sign is for decorations. So I'm going to try one day to just shop for the color tag. And we'll see how far that gets us. But th today is not that day. There's blue in this dress. Does that count? Because this is cute. I had to step out for you guys to see just how pretty this dress was. Remember, I'm always about detail and the structure of this dress, the material, the color, the, it's the color, the color, I love the color. It was just a beautiful dress. And then that cut out in the bag, it's just gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm trying to figure out who would give this away, but I'm happy that you did, because now it goes in my car. This bag right here was cute. It is Punta Cana DR. I might get this for my friend from DR. Yeah. You know, it's cute. It's brand new and it's really cute. I love the colors. I'm quite sure she'll love it. Yeah. Or maybe she'll want to go home. I don't know. When you're shopping, like, do you guys pick up stuff for your family and your friends? I do that. If I see something that I know somebody will like, uh, you know, I'm like, oh, let me snatch this up. And I'm getting it for them and I'll put them in a car. Normally, they're happy. I haven't had any better be like, why you give me this so you know, I'll keep doing it until that day comes when somebody's like, why you buy this for me? And then I will take them off the list of my wonderful thrifting adventures. Cute little crossbody. Really cute. I thought this was a bucket bag. I've been tr looking to thrift a bucket bag. Guys, I always try to thrift it first if I can't find it by the time I'm trying to get that assembled together or that vision, then I'll buy it. But <sighs> thrifting is always first. So I was upset when I found out it wasn't a bucket bag. I mean, I could turn it into a bucket bag, but then it's like, mm, outweigh the cons, right? Pros and cons. All I could say was, ooh la la. In the cart i mean some nice j the, yeah oh, okay you already know it's the glitz for me Anyways, it was a five and a half, so I couldn't get it, but it's a cute shoe, nevertheless. I like this Goodwill. Um, this is my second time coming in here. This is a weapon. This is a weapon. If you have a 70s theme party, then yes, that fits like perfect. But I love the fact that, you know, they're displaying their shoes as well. They have good items as well here um, at this location. This is cute. I'm trying not to buy too many sandals right now, but I mean, you, it's okay if you buy them because duh, I can just have them waiting for next year, right? Um, duh, right? It's going to be spring and summer again. And the bearded dragon has entered in the building. Um, K-Bear loves bearded dragons. I, I don't know. She's going to be a girl in a pink dress with a bearded dragon these were really cute i had some shoes like this a few years back and they really hurt my feet so uh, i'm gonna leave them for somebody else to enjoy i noticed that they had a set of crystals 
crystals and crystal glasses like wine glasses look at that detail so gorgeous and I always have to tap it just to make sure you know it's real but of course it's real it's very heavy and so it was just gorgeous so I definitely had to get those And you already know who this is, the Dirty Birds. Rise up. Yes, the Falcons. This is really pretty. I wasn't sure how it went, like looking at it. And so I was trying to, you know, figure out, of course, you know, I'm gonna hook that up. Of course, like I gotta add belts. I, I gotta add, you know, pinchers and, and, you know, alter it a little bit. But it, once, you know, gathered, gathered, once it's gathered, gathered, then of course it is it's giving what it needs to give. So I thought that was a cute find. And now that I think of it, I should have got those black platforms and gave it more of a 70-ish theme with a clutch bag, a large clutch. Oh, man. All right, well, too late now. With me and fashion, you never know what era I'm going to be in. You never know what genre, type, formal, uh, bell bottoms. We don't know. We, we don't. We don't know. But it's okay. It's okay. I don't know why, but this reminded me of Tyra Banks on uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air in the 90s. So cute with some jeans. Okay. Those are some really nice chairs. So if you guys are looking for chairs, there you go. Overall, I was happy with the pieces that I found here, but now we are going to my other favorite store. Can't wait to get there. See you guys in a minute. Happy National Thrift Day. Super excited. I was excited to thrift. See? <laughs> and in we go. Let's see what finds we can get I almost got knocked over it I mean it was serious it was serious it was like this was like I want to say pre-game but I don't even think it was pre-game this was like the real deal do you see how I'm looking around I'm checking out my corners and everything did you guys know that Will Smith had a clothing brand I didn't I like the shirt but it was a little too small but it was really cute it was it was I don't know if I don't is it Will Smith or Willa Smith I don't I don't know but it was cute and of course, round of applause for this crossbody. And it says Atlanta. And that's my ATL dance that I've been doing all my life. Yeah, because I am a Atlanta native, a Georgia peach, born and raised. Okay. Anywho, and then don't play about the dirty birds. We're not going to go there. We already talked about that. So let's just get back to three things. We don't play about it. Well, okay. Although this is a makeup pouch, I would wear this with an outfit. It's cute. I mean, you know, versatility, right? I love the ombre-esque 
color in here. Oh, okay. I noticed that somebody don't know how to spell Dior. That's okay. It's, it's okay. We know what it was supposed to be, right? <laughs> and nevertheless, it's still a cute bag. I like it and I love the color. Do y'all realize we were wearing weapons on our feet? Anyways, you guys already know I love a fishnet mesh type shoe and this is gorgeous. Oh. And as you all know, we have to stop and let K Bear do her shopping because K Bear does some wonderful shopping sometimes. She even picked out things for me and she has a great sense of style and fashion. And y'all see, she found a bucket purse. It's, it's long, but it's cute on her. So, nevertheless, you know, she picked out her cute dresses. She's at that age where when I pick something out, it's up for a debate. Um, but you know that's that hey she did not like this dress she said no she vetoed it it was another little outfit that i not outfit but it was another you guys are gonna see it it's another little jumpsuit that i really really thought would have been cute on her and she pushed that down with her hand she said no she was adamant it was not happening and she walked away <sighs> yeah that's cute and she was like no but she loved this, of course. Of course she loved it, and I did too. I was like, can I get one of my size? You guys, it was super packed. Like, I mean, I guess everybody knew it was National Thrift Day, so everyone was there. It was more packed than usual. Babies were running into stuff. I mean, you know, then they grabbed on the microphones, but please get your kids. And I was like, yeah, don't do that. Them kids see that toy owl. But, you know, it was super packed. So, ah, ah. And when I'm filming, I don't, I try my hardest not to get like people's faces. I would really be trying. And so, but it was just packed. So, yeah, <laughs> it was packed. And I will not subject you guys to my picture frame addiction right now. I, yeah, it's, it, uh, some picture frames is just so gorgeous, but yeah. Anyways, let's look at some artwork and some paintings and stuff and yeah. You see how pretty that is? Oh, see? And this is another one. And the original price was $35 for this frame. Was it $35 or $53? You guys saw it. Yeah, expensive. I Yes, but a beautiful frame. This was so cute. Someone actually took fabric and made this. This was just pretty. This is gorgeous. Whoever made that, kudos to them. I just love this. And it's an activity that I'm going to do with K-Bear because that's just a cool idea. This is really cute, and I would agree, New York is a wonderful town. If you haven't been, gotta check it out. Great, great food, and the thrifting is awesome. Driving, questionable. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, that's it. All I say, if you are scared to drive, do not drive in New York. Please, don't. Just move, move, move. Don't do it. You're gonna get ran over, I'm, I'm telling you. This is another frame. I like it because I like the border inside of it. I'm not sure what that's called, but I just like the way that is that chrome on the inside of that wood. That's a pretty, it's just pretty to me. This dress was so cute. 
that was a small I didn't get it and then I love this it was a romper type tie like wrap romper I don't know but it was cute and I love the colors so yeah definitely what day do you guys like to go into the thrift stores like are you a Saturday thrifter or is it like are you an everyday thrifter I think that I'm a whenever it comes to my mind thrifting that's that's when I go because I noticed that today was packed and I also noticed that you know it was probably because of you know national thrift day because it's a holiday why wouldn't it be you know what maybe we need to petition for it being a truly recognized holiday and giving everybody a day off just to go thrifting I mean I don't know well let me think about that because if I can't get in the thrift store then I'm gonna just I'm gonna pout I, do, I pout yes I pout Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Do you get, oh my goodness. Do you guys see this? Do you guys see this? If you're new to this channel and you don't know it, I have an obsession with peacocks. My mom just says I am a peacock, but that's that's what my parents call me. They're like, yeah, yeah, you're just a peacock. I love peacocks. Do you see this? My two favorite things, a mumu and a peacock. Come on, come on. I'm gonna find a way to stay in the house just to wear it. Look at it. This was super gorgeous, but I do not need to buy another formal, formal, that's not formal. I don't need to buy another formal dress either. Like, wow, but I'm mad that that came out. I don't need to buy another floral dress. Not right now. But if it accidentally fell in the cart, I can't do anything about that. I mean, you know, you don't want to hold up the line when you're checking out, um, you know, so if it just fell in the cart, it just, just has to go home, right? <laughs> this was such a cute jean skirt. I love that. I love the little split in the front. I know it's by Universal Thread. I know that's a Target brand, but yeah, it was really cute. And when did they start putting shoes up there? That's new. I didn't see these. Are these cute? They aren't they cute, right? When they started that, make sure you guys are checking those end caps because they're starting to hang items there. And this is giving me 70s chic. I was going to start singing You Can Ring My Bell, but then I realized my mom watches these vlogs and I'm leaving it at that. This shirt fits this day perfectly. Seriously. I need to run up to the cash register and put it on, real, buy it and put it on real quick. This is so cute. I didn't, I was trying to understand if it was uh, attached to detached and I don't know, but it was cute. When I tell you back in the 2014 to 17s, I only wore these shirts. As you can see in the picture up there, I only wore these shirts. Now, not so much. Not so much. I 
I'm super convinced that people are making this a holiday with their family and coming into the goodwill because the amount of families in the crowd, wow. These are really cute. And I think it would be so cute with that vest that I picked up earlier. I think that would just be a cute outfit with like a little chain belt. Take it all the way back to the, the um, what is it? What did y'all call it? Y2K? I'm going to say the early 2000s. But yeah, Y2K. These are cute and of course free flowing with a nice wide leg. I was holding up the stuff because I thought that the camera was facing the mirror and it was not because K Bear was directing the cart at this moment. So hopefully y'all can see all of the stuff <laughs> that's in the cart um i don't know i don't know As always, thank you guys for shopping with us. And don't forget to love yourself. You cannot love anyone else unless you truly love yourself. See you later. Toodles.